What's up guys and welcome to another video. This video is going to be about the Halo Infinite news that just came out yesterday and it's probably one of their biggest updates yet. You're not going to want to miss this. Just a quick reminder for you, I stream every single weekday at 5 p.m. Eastern. Twitch links in the description below. So this is the update for March 2021 of Halo Infinite. They do one every single month at the end of the month on a Thursday most of the time. That's what they're shooting for, at least they said. And this one was definitely by far one of the best updates I've seen of yet. And it's because of it being a very important part of the game, the audio, what you hear in the game, what you hear when you're playing the game, the sounds of the weapons, the sounds of the environment, and everything like that. I wanna go over one of the first things that we heard in this update, and that's going to be the difference between the Halo 5 battle rifle and the Halo Infinite battle rifle. So some of you might be really accustomed to this sound. This is the Halo 5 sound. We'll play it again. So you've heard that before. That's something that you've definitely heard before, I would imagine. Uh, now we're going to go ahead and we're going to look at the Halo Infinite battle rifle sound. And now listen to how clear this really is. It is so beautiful in the fact that it is so deep and, and it shows that that weapon is powerful. The battle rifle, one of the most powerful weapons in Halo as a primary weapon. You know, Spartans using it all the time. It's it's a big weapon in the lore and everything like that. I'm not really into lore, but in multiplayer, I know it's one of the most iconic Halo weapons of all time. And what that sound does right there is it really showcases that fact. And I love that. One of the really big things in this blog was talking about the custom built acoustic simulation. And this basically was developed by the developers at 343 to give us a more realistic feel to where we are in the game. So if you're in a building, it'll sound like you're in that building. If you're if you're in a building encased in metal, the, the sound will bounce differently. If you're, you know, in an open area and there's a tree next to you and the sound comes from behind you, it's, it could bounce off that tree. There's, there's stuff like that makes it really realistic so that when you're in an area, you know like you feel like you're in that area and i think that's a, getting us a step closer to that halo uh virtual reality which would be really cool another thing they talk about in this update is here in the campaign they talk about the you know audio emitters like around the grass and in an environment things that like like birds and wind that kind of make noises when you're passing by these things you will hear them right next to you you'll, you'll hear the grass as you walk through it stuff like that it, it, it makes again it makes it so much more of an immerse uh, immersing experience to be able to have these audio updates i really do feel like audio is a very extremely like almost like top two part of a video game that brings people back and immerses people in the in the story and, and it makes the story valuable it makes multiplayer valuable as well i have one of the that had the battle rifle sound that you just heard, pre heard previously in my stream as a follower alert and every time that follower alert goes off i literally like oh like it actually like sets me back because it's strong it's powerful and it, it's impactful and i think that's really really important when it comes to stuff like this over here they talk about the forerunner interior you can kind of get go through and listen to that you can go to the blog yourself and take a listen to that but i'll give you a couple seconds here i did listen to the whole thing to see if there was anything like any secret stuff in there and i couldn't really find anything but i'm sure people will dig a lot further uh, in the future here they show the skewer it's a new banished weapon for the infinite they show this on screen as well and, and this is going to be really cool because this allows us to hear some sounds uh, from the impact so this is the impact sound uh punch and body so it's you know the weapon kind of like you know this part of the weapon the melee melee part of the weapon hitting and that's i mean that's pretty cool uh, of course that's a very short kind of thing but this is the mech part of the weapon this is since the skewer uh, fires in a, a large spear it really needs some strong mechanical elements such as thick metal clanks and deep slides and uh, again you're gonna hear that um you know this is the sci-fi sci-fi part of the weapon I love that right there. That that is that's the tail. So that gives you a, a sense of environment in which the gun is being fired in, the reflections of the gunshot bouncing off the environment. So again, like that's the environment around you and how these shots and how these weapons are gonna play and sound in those environments. Listen to this one more time. 
It's just so nice. It's so beautiful. Like it's it just sounds so good. Like one more time. Had to put the sound there a little bit a little bit louder so we could hear it better. But um, let's see it. So this is oh, see this is one. Of, this is a shot from you're shooting this now. Listen to this. It, it, it's so sick. Listen to the back and the tail end of it. So you again, it, it, depending on the environment you're in, like these are powerful weapons, man. Like they sound so powerful. This is something I definitely want you guys to check out. Possibly we'll, we'll we'll listen to a little, like maybe a couple minutes of it. But this is the sample track, kind of showing you everything. Uh, a lot of new things inside this sample track. It, you know, it gives you uh, the you hear the beam rifle at some point. You hear a sniper. I'm gonna go over the to the tail end end of it because I want you to hear the sniper flying by your face. The sniper shot. Listen to this. I'm gonna go to the tail end here. We're gonna go to two minutes. We're gonna listen to one minute of it. But just listen to. Tell me where you think where you think you hear the snipe. I'll point it out. But listen up. goodness I like i have that as my alarm right now it wakes me up in the morning every single morning i have this as my alarm it is loud enough it wakes me up and i feel like i'm in a halo battlefield and it's great and then my kids can see dad wide awake in the morning when i uh, when i have to bring him through school and stuff like that but just a really cool kind of just a really cool kind of sample track that allows us to see so many different things of course this is another great watch they actually added this a little bit after i didn't see this when the vlog first came out um but again a lot of great things in here a lot of great stories but the biggest thing for me was the sounds and what they talk about in terms of like how they're messing with the systems to make them different halo 5 to the halo infinite battle rifle is such an insane difference i can't i'm mind blown by it honestly it is literally the biggest it's the biggest impact to me because I've used you know the Halo 5 battle rifle was my favorite. I obviously Halo 2 and Halo 3 are my two favorite games and they had the battle rifle start in terms of MLG and competitive. So I've listened to a lot of battle rifle in my life and let me tell you something, Infinite's battle rifle is literally the best battle rifle I've ever heard and I love it. It's it, it just it gives me a lot more hope for this game knowing that they have these systems in place to make us immerse and make us want to play again the next day and wake up in the morning you know that that feeling when the game comes out and you are you, you go to bed at two o'clock in the morning and they wake up at like six and you're like I'm ready to go again like you freak out and you want to get out of bed to play that's the feeling I want for Halo Infinite and I really think they're hitting the nail on the head here in terms of you know audio and and I love that uh, this is definitely a little bit of a, a shorter update in terms of like my YouTube video but I just kind of wanted to go over the big parts of this update in terms of you know the way the sound works and and all of these things that they're working on all of these systems as well the next update is something I'm very much looking forward to and that's going to be the Halo Infinite PC update so we're gonna talk about a lot of things in terms of the PC and how a Halo Infinite is going to play on PC and that I am very very excited about we'll have to see more coming on that next month so we'll have to wait till april to see that update uh let me see the last day in april is going to be the last it's going to be the 29th so we gotta wait till april 29th in order to see more halo infinite news hopefully we'll get ask 343 coming pretty shortly they usually kind of put those uh, out right after the blog post or a little bit after the blog post so we'll wait for that that should be interesting and we'll see what they talk about there. Anyway, guys, it has been great. I hope you enjoyed this type of update where I kind of go through here and tell you different things, go through the blog, tell you the important stuff. There's a lot to read here, so if you're in the mood, I would definitely read it. I actually also went through it on my read broadcast on my Twitch. You can kind of hear me go through it all, and I put some voices on it and, and make it interesting. So check that out if you want. I will talk to you all later. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.